United haven't been out of the back 30 for the uh, last couple of minutes. Good run by Izzet, can he keep the ball in play? Gets around Neville, remarkable run by him, Forster Collins, Forster Heskey, and it's there, Leicester City take the lead. Not the prettiest of goals, but boy, was it effective. Emil Heskey is known for his power and his pace, but that was a delicate little touch after some desperate defending by Manchester United. Is it treading the tightrope that is the touchline? Well, he's OK. He's very OK. Emil Heskey! Oh, what a stunning strike! From Leicester's own, Emil Heskey! Seconds after receiving treatment, he got up, he kept going and going. And Emil Heskey gives the Gunners a kick up the Arsenal. Heskey, lovely piece of control, he's got three Leeds men around him. This is a great run from Heskey, it's a lovely finish, and it's Tony Cotte! 76 minutes, Leicester into the lead. Well, you won't see many better goals than that. And it was all the work from Heskey on that right-hand side. An initially perfect piece of control. Then he turned and he took and he had Granville, Boyer and Molinar around him. Still got the cross in and Cotty got there first. Just needing that little spark of invention from somewhere, you feel Leicester. Heskey could provide it, he's got room here. Oh, what a goal! What a brilliant goal from Emil Heskey. Marvellous goal. Well, that's what he can do. And if Glenn Hoddle was watching this, he may well be persuaded that this young man is worth a go for England. He spun Vega, and the finish was Thunderbolt into the roof of the net. That is one of the best individual goals you will see all season. Spun superbly. Elliot very much the danger man in the air. Guppy to take it. And then a cracking strike that was going to give the Leicester the victory. Muzzy is it. What a volley. What a goal in a game absolutely full of them. It's the third goal of the night, and the third that you'd call a mini-classic. Ferdinand's clearance, and Muzzy is it, with a terrific volley as late as the 86th minute. This looks like a Leicester winner. Wonderful goal. Lennon. And Heskey's away here! in from Cotty and Leicester's in-form strikers combine and Cotty makes it five goals in five games for the Filbert Street Foxes Tony Cotty is enjoying a new lease of life at Leicester the big man Heskey found the little man Cotty. And it's Leicester City 1, Liverpool 0. Q. 
cue from uh, Walker. It's a terrible header from Hinchcliffe. Cotte! Oh, dear, oh, dear. Hinchcliffe's header. And Cotte, well, he's the goal poacher supreme. Well, it all started with a miscue from uh, Walker. And out of your shot there was Hinchcliffe. It was his header. And Cotte pounced on to put Leicester ahead on 33 minutes. United one up here. Leicester trying to do something about it with Steve Guppy. Here's Zagarakis. Can he get his shot in? Yes, he can! And it's a screamer! From Theo Zagarakis! What a superb goal! And how much of a lift has that given Leicester? They've been struggling so far. But Zagarakis unleashed an unstoppable drive. That was simply wonderful. It's 1 1. Wing wizard, and he really was a wizard, wasn't he, in those days when Forrest were winning European Cups? Here is Izzy to Cotti. And yes, Leicester City may be back in business. Tony Cotti again. And that is the first time a striker has scored a league goal for Leicester in 1999. Good finish by Cotty. Difficult angle, that was not easy. But again, he still has the craft. Shouldn't be too much of a foreign problem for Chris Perry, and it isn't. Oh, but that's a miscue by Sullivan, straight to Guppy. Well struck, what a goal! Fantastic goal by Steve Guppy! Well, that was one of the strikes of the season. It all came from a miscue from goalkeeper Neil Sullivan. It fell to Guppy, but the goalkeeper could not have dreamt that Steve Guppy would come up with an exquisite finish like that. You will not see the ball struck better than this, I suggest, all season. Whoa, tremendous. Taggart. Finding Lennon. He skips past Kinsella. That has Rufus to contend with. Taggart back to Lennon! It's a beauty! From Neil Lennon. A simply stunning strike. Free kick for Leicester. Little flick on, it's in. Leicester City take the lead. And the supporters are delighted. says the referee and this is a good run from Leicester City they've got a chance here and they score two now we've got a game on because Tony Cotty has given them a two goal advantage with their only chance in the second half a breakaway goal and Leicester lead by two goals to nil but they were without a win in nine games coming into this one it looks like they may have stopped the rot although Savage has a chance to start a Leicester recovery. A fine finish. A lovely lob from Savage. Cuts the deficit to 2 1. Guppy. Heskey. Now Leicester passing the ball as though they really believe something can happen here. Guppy on his right foot, brilliant goal by Steve Guppy!
One of the comebacks of the season is complete. You never know with Leicester City. You simply never know. But if Steve Guppy never scores another goal with his right foot, he'll always have this one to remember. Frankly unstoppable, no blame attached to De Hoy, but the defenders in front of him. Impy. And that's going to go all the way through to Ian Marshall, who has surely won it for Leicester in injury time. It's been an injury play campaign for Marshall. But he will remember this moment. Haman. Elliot. Guppy. Cotty takes over. Oh, that is wonderful. Well, in Leicester's last home match. How fitting that Tony Cotty should score a goal like that. What a season he's had.